Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Quicksell. Give them hell with Quicksell. Okay, well, we've jumped systems. We are now in the Kendall system. So let's have a quick look at navigation. I couldn't get a five skull planet, so it's a four and a half, which isn't too, too bad. There's a few other four and a halfs around, uh, like Huntington. It was a few more days away than um, Kendall was. So I decided to go here because um, we would have had to go through another financial report if we went there. So uh, that being said, we have enough C bills for another financial report. Um, but I'm going to jump straight into a battle today. We're going to do two missions before the financial report. We're going to play today. We're going to do. Uh, let's go to the command center. We're going to do an, a. We're going to do a four and a half skull assassination against the uh, Marian hegemony. And uh, let's see here. Yeah, so it's assassinate in an urban environment. It's an elite mech warrior who's taking command of the system. So hopefully you'll have a good mech. There should be two lances of defenders. There's one there to protect him, and then there's another one coming in. So. That should be 10 against 6. So let's see. We're going to go 312, keep the uh, C bills up. And we'll do the same thing. However, we do have the Atlas and the Godzilla back. So we're going to bring them in today. So let's load. Okay, we got our Lance loaded. So we're going to take the Avatar out and the Savage Wolf out and bring you down. I'm, I'm hoping I pulled the right Avatar out. Let's just make sure here. So I want to keep the MRM in which I believe is this guy. Yes, we want to keep the MRM version in. We're taking the laser version out because we've got PPCs on the Atlas. Right? Yeah, PPCs and the heavy improved Gauss rifle. All right, let's bring these guys into play and let's see how this goes. Uh, that's not load. Let's just go. Wait, we're overweight? Is that where we are? 420 and we're what? 425. So we got to swap out, I think, one of the Afrites. Wait, these are 40, aren't they? Yeah, they're 40. Okay. Um, maybe we don't take the Bandit match and we take both Avatars instead. I like the double AC-20, especially for up against tough opponents. But let's go with the laser-filled Avatar. Uh, yeah, so we'll bring you into here. We'll leave you where your pilot is the best, and we'll take the Atlas and put you down here. All right, now we can do it, right? 420? Should be ready to go. We're rated at three and a half skulls with two assault mechs? Sure. Yeah, you say that, but I doubt it. Command interface initiated. All right, well, here we go, down the city. Looks like we got a lance off to the right. That's our guy. Um, catapult? No. It's hard to tell from the front view. There's so many mechs now, it's like impossible to tell sometimes. And there's the reinforcement. Let's so we've got... Money. I spotted a lance over here. Right here. And then there's these guys. Near the main guy. So I think what we're going to do, if we can... Where are they? Right there is we're going to try and take those guys out first. So they can't get to the main boss. Now they're right in the corner. Mm, then maybe we take these guys out. But that allows this guy to shoot at us too, right? I'm just trying to avoid that. I want to kind of engage him last. Maybe we can... I think being in the open is a bad idea though. Uh, we want to go down this ramp if we're going to go that way, but then we're going to be in a, we'll be in a kill zone for these guys. So, God, I don't like the start position. We're kind of sandwiched. I've played through this before. Um, I'm going to start up here, I think. I think we can avoid that guy. We scoot past this opening. So let's start up here. And we're going to go after these guys first. It'll take a while for the guys down here, unless they're fast, to get to us. So we should be able to smoke these guys. There's an archer, it looks like. Could be a stealth, but I think it's an archer. Hello. 
Yeah, Archer. Oh, what do we got back here? This looks like a grasshopper. Spot for an ambush. Oh, it does, does it? Be careful, Commander. You don't want to get caught in the crossfire. Doesn't matter where we drop, we're going to be caught in the crossfire. We got the firepower, though. I think we should be fine. So this guy is the uh, catapult. Laser pult. Beautiful. And he's turned sideways, too. Who are you? Somebody that's invisible. Could have been an executioner or something. I don't know. May have been an assassin. Roughneck. Alright, so it's mediocre. Individually, it's mediocre resistance. Um, so far. Wow, they're fast, though. Yes, Commander. Um, Archer has not gone yet. Nope, Skipper. let's go this route. Mm -hmm. Let's go here. Okay, there's the guy that we saw. There's a wraith. Okay. Eyes on now. Good targeting with this guy. We will hammer... Oh, Jesus, he's a rocket launcher. We gotta kill this guy this turn. That's gonna be bad. Eight rocket launchers. Twenties. Alright, well... That's act that would actually be a really, really nice frame to grab, too. Yeah, everybody's got to shoot that guy. So we got a Jenner on that side, so it's not a big deal over there. Waiting for orders. It's this side we got to worry about. All right, we need to get in on him now. I'm not going to expose, so the archer will make a move to us. Confirmed. I think we should be able to pull this guy down this turn. Um... Ye not incendiary Apollos. We've got to kill this guy. So let's do it. PPC missed. Damn. Oh, sorry, we'll strip all his armor off here. Unstable. There you go. Now you're dead. As long as the Godzilla can see him, he's pretty much screwed. But we're pretty slow, so I don't know if that's going to happen. Oof, nice shot. You need me to hold still for you? You were. Good to go. Yeah, Godzilla's not going to make it. Oh, and I'm wrong. No, I'm not. Hmm. Let's get as far as we can go. Confirmed. It's all drippings, Miss Goo. I mean, we could take a shot over here and hopefully hit this guy. Hmm. Save the AP for heavier armored guys, but we're going to fire across this way. Alright, we got a bit on him. And we took that building out handily enough. Ready to rock. Alright, Nasty, I need you to get Nasty on that some bitch. Move to that guy. That guy can't see. Actually, you know what? Can we get better range? It kind of puts you in the way of everybody, though. Not there, though. We're not going to get better range, so we'll do that. At least the AMSs are up close. Yeah, just hammer him. Okay. PPC's gone. On One rocket. Confirmed. That's weird that the rockets were being the torso. Alright. I got you. Full on. Alright, so I think we gotta we think we def definitely need to take this lance at least one red like half red skull minimum. Just gonna fire it like this, it's fine. I'm on. That should be it for this guy, I think. Nope. 
There goes the torso, though. That and the knockdown. Pilot should be down to one. Yep. Even if he gets up, he's probably not going to hit with much. So we just got the Atlas left. I don't think he's got enough movement to get into place. That's fine. Man, the Archer can still deal out damage. Systems holding. Got five of them anyway. Ready for orders. Ready for orders. Oh my god, you can't see him. So the movement's not too bad in the city. Going full throttle. I thought it was gonna be a lot slower than this, but it's not too bad. Not too bad at all. We can't use the heavy improve because we were running. So we'll just leave that off. Um I wanna leg him or do we just want to hit? We're probably going to hit the leg anyway, so let's just go for the head. See if we get a lucky shot in on him. Copy that. Everything hit, but we didn't get the head. Okay. Alright, we should be able to kill this guy and hopefully the archer this turn. Then it's just the two weaker guys left. Yep. Systems holding. They better be holding. We put a lot of money into that, Atlas. Where are you going, buddy? Where are you going? You're up there, are you? Oh, that's not bad. Good maneuver. No, no idea what else is over here. The Roughneck, Archer, Jenner. Okay, so it's not too bad. Minimal damage on that hit. Wait, what was the last guy? Two roughnecks. And what's our main guy back here? It looks like a catapult. It does look like it was a catapult then. I guess it's probably the um, the the laser pult, or it could be one of those rocket ones. But I mean, it, the guy's supposed to be uh, an advanced mech warrior, so I wasn't expecting like a rocket pult. It would be something a little bit tougher than that, I would imagine. Um, guy on the ground's going on eleven. That's before a lot of us. So we got iron sides going. What are your orders, Skipper? With the MRMs. So let's get over here. Acknowledge, Commander. I'm gonna try and go after the. Uh, I don't want to have to use my mechs on this guy if I if I don't need to. Let's go for there. As uh, my booster. I keep, you know, anyway. Uh, let's try for the kill. I'm going to drop two quad missiles on him. Ten four. Not quite enough. Rocket crit, though. Critical hit. My short range missiles are out. Yeah, he can't fire, so we got to uh, kill him. Got to use the mech to kill him. I was really hoping we could go after the archer, but not happening. That's fine. That's fine. Sever the arm. Let's see what you got. Boom. Yeah, he had a lot of... He, he had like a rocket 80 on that side. I couldn't let that happen. Couldn't let that happen. Because even with a low percentage chance to hit, he's still going to hit with a bunch of them. And I just don't want to get hit. What's up, boss? What's up, boss? How about we show this guy what a real missile launcher should look like, eh? What do you say we do that? Here's what you should have. Oh my god, I feel like almost all of them hit. Reporting critical hit. Have a seat, buddy. Oh, apparently not. I guess putting him into complete instability and then uh, blowing his arm off has no effect on whether he's going to fall or not. Alright. I got a feeling, like, once we take out a couple mechs, the archer and the other, one, one other guy on this side, I'm just gonna make my way to the main guy and let the rest of them catch up to us. I don't really think they've got the firepower here to, uh, threaten us significantly in any way. There's the archer there. 
So I'm not that worried about it. Ah, uh, yeah, I know. I know. I know. Do that. Copy that, Commander. We're giving the Wraith a back shot, but he doesn't have that much that I have to worry about. I'm gonna kill this guy, though. Engage target. Or not. Here's the knockdown. Ha. So he should be wounded twice now. Yep. Receiving you. Vengeance is yours. Can we get a shot off on anybody? Now I can use the Thunderbolt. All right, we're going to start moving this way. We're a little bit unstable, so let's go ahead and use some Vigilance, because we know we're going to take a shot from the other archer. So let's try a Thunderbolt shot on this guy. Why not? While well, we can. See if we can take the leg. Copy that. Damn nope. It. Waiting for orders. It's not like we really needed to supplement our firepower anyway, so... Ah, uh, fuck it. Atlas is going this way. Just gonna go for the main guy. Our two uh, vehicles plus our two mechs here can easily handle this side, no problem. Yeah, I gotta say, really loving the MRM-30 build, or the MRM-60 build. It feels really, really nice. And I thought maybe adding a couple of more, like a couple, a pair of MRM-10s would really round it out. But I'm thinking that the actual, actually having the lasers and stuff on the PPC is actually better, a better choice. Getting some nice pinpoint shots in as well. It just feels better with the lasers. That way if I run out of ammo, I mean I shouldn't, but oh shit, I forgot about this. If I run out of ammo, I should be fine. I could still use the lasers, you know. These two guys are going to take on this whole this whole other side. There should be no problem. We'll meet you at the leader. Crap a pulp. Here he comes. I think we got a lot of those. 24. It's pretty nice. Ready for orders. Ready for orders. Wait. Oh yeah, he moved. Oh yeah, he moved. We're pretty darn warm, but uh, our flyer's in the way. Oh boy. It's better to get a side shot anyway, so let's just walk up here. On the move. He's unstable. Much like me. Uh, let's go with we got plenty of Apollo. Let's just hit him. Acknowledged. We'll get rid of his evasion and then we'll shoot him with something else. Probably got the build. Yeah, we got the building as well. They've got a lock on me. Yeah, it took off that whole orders? one point of evasion that you had. Uh, you're damaged mostly on one side, right? Yeah. I could shoot him in the back, but I think we're going to do this. Yeah. Like that. Affirmative, Commander. Like that. Divide and conquer. Um, let's just go for the kill on this guy. We've got enough for later on, so... Here we go. If we can get a quick kill here, that'd be good. There we go. I need a new target. My SRMs are out. That's all right. They did the job. They did Orders. the job. I'm going to have to get a uh, a Godzilla sound for every time I move this guy. Well. All right, not so bad. Gonna fire at him. Wow, like almost everything hit. Nicely done. Stripping some armor. It doesn't feel like it's as heavy hitting though. Although it does have like it does have the range. I guess that's the huge benefit. Because it has massive range. Alright. Um 
Not a lot of direct fire from this side. Well, maybe not. I was going to... Uh, no, I guess not. I was going to say there's a, not a lot of direct fire from that side, and there certainly isn't. Can I get... I can. I can. I can get a shot at this guy. Guy in the ground's like, oh, shit. Yo, what's up? Mm, let's just go for the kill because I don't really want parts off this guy anyway. See ya. Enemy eliminated. You guys see what I mean though? Like the Godzilla, it's got the range, Skipper. but it doesn't feel like it hits very hard compared to like that Avatar. Like that volley just seemed really devastating in particular, right? So where are you damaged? Mostly on this side. So let's get a side shot off on you. I'm rolling. You know, this the avatar just seems more deadly. Now it doesn't have as much armor, but it does it is faster. Copy that. Oh, it's on now. Standing by. It's on like Donkey Kong. Uh let's Vigilance. Because I want to go ahead of the next guys. Let's move up to here. See if we can kill this grasshopper. I turned poorly there. And that's my fault. So if we use this, does it give us a percentage chance to be knocked down? It does, but let's try it. If we get knocked over, we get knocked over, but I want to fire this thing. Just see how it works here. Oh, yeah, we missed. Peeps landed, though. Took out a whole building. Of course the guy doesn't fall. I know it's a pilot check and everything, and they're good pilots. I get that, but... It just seems like as soon as I reach the end, I'm always falling. It's psychological. So, what are you shooting? Yes, Commander. Can't be ATMs. I mean, I guess it could be. Um, here's what we're gonna do. No, we got... Plenty of guys on that side. I'm gonna walk. Actually, I'm gonna sprint to get in a little closer over here. Confirmed. And then we're gonna post up and just stand there and use the heavy gauss rifle on these guys. Just shoot the PPCs here. The ATM. Soften this Jenner up a little bit. Okay, one big hit. Pen the armor. We gotta destroy this statue. It's a Marion statue, it's gotta go! I'm shocked we didn't see any Quicksell guys in this lineup. That's why we're here. Orders. Alright, double R. I'm gonna walk it. Roger. Lose our instability. And we'll give this guy a full Apollo launch. Um not adding any heat. Adds a little bit. We'll leave the medium lasers off, but we'll fire the rest. Don't hit our own guy in the back, please. Target acquired. See ya. That hit something good. Well, that's it for that, Lance. Really hoping for a tougher, but whatever. Yeah, I think if we brought the other two, the Bandersnatch and the other guy. And the Savage Wolf, that is. It prob we probably would have been fine. Damage is light. But I just wanted to test these two out. So now, I mean, we have a good idea now of where we can go. We'll go to a half... We'll go half Skull Red with this Lance and see what happens. Well, somebody's got some rockets. My armor's getting stripped off. Is it? It's hard for me to notice. Ready to rock. Hard for me to notice past all the screaming. All right, let's move. Stop screaming. Keep the comms clear. Alright. That's all we can do. Uh, yep. Nasty, same thing. We're gonna stay behind the mechs and move forward. Quick shift. 
definite. Let the armor take what it's supposed to do. It's gonna cost a lot, but that's fine. That's Let's why we take the big numbers for, for salvage. Somebody's got some AMS over there. Waiting for orders. Oh my god. Move order received. <laughs> That's why. I uh, got I, I, The long range, it's like this guy's. Look at. Combat shotgun. Roughneck version. Alright. Um, sure, let's put the Thunderbolt on and see if we can get it. I don't think we'll get a quick kill. But you can see what I mean about the numbers. It's not really that high in damage. Aye, aye. <laughs> Compared to the avatars, it's probably doing about the same amount of damage overall. Just the advantage is that it's obviously because it's got the, uh... Let's go this way. It's got more, way more armor. We'll go like that. Cool off here. Alright, we got some half decent initiative. No, we don't. Never mind, I take it back. Why I even open my mouth sometimes, I don't know. Your rockets are gone. Oh, it's the other guy. Never mind. Atlas should go before him, though. He's on what? Four? No, Atlas is on ten. Hmm. Hopefully he doesn't knock us over. Oh, he's a regular catapult. Direct fire. Line of fire. I think he's got those... What are they called? The, not the Zeus. Losing armor. The uh, long fires or whatever, which is why they were doing so much damage before. Oh, yeah. Here comes the... Uh, here comes the knockdown. Oh, no. Really? Oh, you know what? That's a rocket archer. Distance holding. 6W? Yeah, I bet you he had just rockets. Yeah, he did. I thought it was one of the roughnecks. I don't know why I thought that, but... Boy, instability is going to be a real issue with these two. Taking heavy hits, Commander. Took a hard hit there. Yeah, it's going to be a real issue with these two. All right. Confirmed. Boomer. Uh, you got to go this way if we're going to hunt that guy. So. Roger, Skipper. Take full it. speed. Sounds good. We are sorely out of position here. Ready to rock. All right, let's get on this Jenner. Double time. Let's go. Hopefully we can kill him real quick here. Hopefully he goes down really fast. Hello. Copy that. Dorsal shots, beautiful. Engine destroyed. Start See ya. Down, thank you. Skipper. Well, thank you. Well, thank you very much. Can you go and shut that other idiot up? Where is he? Yeah, I need you to like shut that guy down. I don't know if my bombs will be from up here. We'll see. See if we can shut him up. Just for a couple turns, we'll drop some mines down there too. If we got the range. I don't know if we do or not. Oh yeah, we do. Uh I gotta wait till next turn. Guys remind me, okay? Jet booster, gotta turn it off. Primary target damage, Commander. Okay, not too bad. Multiple weapons. 49 heat, and he's in flame, in the flames. He's in, uh, minefield. Um, I think your best bet is to come this way. Understood. Full speed, sounds good. Not very full, but we'll be up on the hill here. Hopefully we can just shoot down and, uh, yes, Commander. see those guys. Alright, um, vigilance. Confirmed. Yeah, I mean... Let's go after... 74 across the board. Let's go after the guy that uh, has been damaged. See if we can get a kill on him. Gonna overheat here. Hey, did I not vigilance this? I was sure I vigilanced that. And now that I've vigilanced somehow... Oh, no, never mind. Yeah. Gotta leave one of these off. That's fine. Hopefully the big one lands. Actually, do I have... Well, it's 
not going to help too much. But we're using it because I got to start using them again. Actually, can I sneak that under? I can't. I can't shut down either, so let's go this route. Oh, yeah. Wide open. Commander. He's wide open. Do I want to shoot that guy, though? No. Let's go for the, uh... On my way. Let's go for these idiots. Let's go for the kill over here. Yeah, we shouldn't need much more than that, I don't think. Roger. Well, I guess we did. Solid connection on that one. I guess we did. Who's left? Let's Nobody. Well, at least we got good initiative, kind of. From a couple of people. Yeah. You run. Run. Oh, is he closing or is he running? He's closing. Okay, not too bad. We're losing a lot of armor, though. Alright, what are you up to? Gonna need more than that, buddy. Systems holding. Gonna need Going more than that. This guy's just got a couple of lasers left. I can probably just kill him with the uh the freaks. Waiting for orders. Do I want to move? Actually, I do. Just so that guy can't get a direct line of sight on me. We'll walk up. We'll shoot this guy with the peeps. We should be fine that way. Aye, aye. Should get the kill here if we hit the CT. But why would we hit the CT? Because, you know, we might as well play with our food a little longer. <sighs> Fucking story of my life. At least they're engaging. God damn it. Damage is light. Receiving you. It's been so many times we've played where the enemy just doesn't engage us, you know? They run. I copy. These guys don't care though. Ah, ah this has got lots of back armor. I'm not that worried. <laughs> we'll leave this one off then. We'll just fire the uh, Apollos on the uh, archer. You can try and shoot that down with AMS, but there's no point. Ready to rock. There's just no point. Hi, Skipper. Full speed. No target. He should be fine. He's got lots of evasion. Lots of evasion. We're gonna go after the guy's damage, though. Hopefully, get the kill here. You. There you go. There you go. Bye bye. Thanks for uh, showing up. Um, before I forget. Turn that off. Hey, hey, look at that. I'm learning, kind of. Um, do I want to... I kind of want to leave their leader for my mechs. Is it still calculating my distance? It is. Discovered that's why when you click it doesn't do anything because it's still calculating the distance, so it just stops. You got it. Stops you from moving until it knows what it's what it where it can go. Okay. Hopefully we're hidden from that. Catapult, take a shot at this guy. A little bit of damage. Not much. Confirmed. He's unstable. Let's see if we can get we can't. Still one turn away. Orders. No. If we're gonna do this. Position confirmed. We're gonna do it this way. Cause screw this guy. Uh do we have Warlord? Confirmed. 
marginally better, but whatever. Oof, nice. I don't know whether I like this better than just like having three standard Gauss rifles. The Hag is really nice for capitalizing on crits. Or crap, capitalizing on open areas with crits, I mean, but... My old mama can hit harder than that. I don't know. It's hard to... It's hard to punch those big holes when you're only doing like 50 with the uh, light gauss, especially against like heavy and assault mechs. So, which is the reason why I wanted to make sure the uh, the Atlas could at least support it with a couple of PPCs and that uh, heavy gauss. As long as we can open up some areas. Although I think we've got to get an AMS on this guy if we can. Yeah, I don't know. Standing by. Uh, let's go after the archer. Can I? Yep. I mean, I'm kind of like playing with my playing with my food at this point, but it's so fun. Um, yeah. Let's put it all on. It might hit. It might not. Copy that. Not so bad. Unstable. Skipper. Okay, we're gonna switch. We're gonna switch. Uh, let's get up high. We're gonna Not shoot the bad, archer man. again, and then our other guy with the infernos are gonna go overheat the uh, the big boss man. All right, firing on this guy. Well, crits in the rocket don't matter. What are your orders, Skipper? All right, nasty. I need you to get nasty on this some bitch over here. Where is he? Where are you? There you are, you turd blossom. Nope. Up here, please. There you go. Drop a bomb on him. So just the standard catapult. I don't really care about this guy then. Let's bake his noodle. Firing. Yeah. At least it's a knockdown. Never mind, he's dead. Well, he's not dead, but he will be in a second. It's just so brutal. The fact that you can, like, shut down a mech Skipper. just that quickly, with, uh, and then... Roger, Skipper. Taking it. Like, you can just target the biggest, baddest enemy, the biggest threat, just shut them down, and then finish them off real quick. It's Here a huge bonus. Is that a knockdown? That's a knockdown. Gotta be a knockdown. He looks tired. He just looks real tired. Good to go. He's like, maybe if I just lie here, they'll go away. I'll just lie here. They'll just not know I'm here. Did we get the leg or do we kill the engine? Ah, uh, we don't get to kill the other guys? Oh, we do. Okay, never mind. Receiving you. I was going to say there for a second. Oh. Uh, I gotta do it. I mean, like, if we get that shot, it's just gonna be brilliant. But I doubt it. Yeah, that was a CT hit, I think. Critical hit, Commander. Yeah, he's not gonna stay there. Because even the Atlas with the heavy Gauss and the two PPCs just feels like it's more do doing more damage than the Godzilla. Just, I guess it's just a difference in loadout, you know. And I think if we're going to run the Atlas like this... See what, you get. what we what we do need, though, is maybe get a dedicated AMS or... Confirmed. Something with a really heavy AMS. I got you. Maybe a pair of advanced or something and lots of ammo. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. At least the tandems aren't jammed. Copy that. 
Guy's got a pretty good loadout for a standard roughneck. What are your orders, Skipper? Can you see him? Oh, you can just fire from there. Don't step in front of the Atlas if you can avoid it. 10-4. Medium sit, nice. Not bad. Commander. Uh I guess this guy's dead. Alright, let's give it to this guy over here then. Let's give it to this guy over here. Here you go. Confirmed. Can't say you didn't deserve it. Okay. Uh, Ready for orders. Can you get a shot at him? You can. Can you get a better shot at him? You can, but only if we're sh shooting through our guys. Nope. Yep. We'll take that shot. We got good back armor. Should be okay. Uh, let's switch to AP. Huh. The damage fall off is brutal. Gotta rethink that. Let's fire these. Uh, didn't get didn't get anything Ready to rock. on the crit tri on the uh, crit side of things, but let's get actually where are you hurt? All over, but mostly from that side. So let's vigilance you, so we can get ahead of our big guns. And we'll come over on this side. So if we don't get the kill, then we can move out of the way and fire. Oh crap! Oh. I did it with one, that but not me. the other. Oh, for crying out loud. Well, target. I don't know why I thought I didn't think this one had a booster. Every F in time. Shouldn't miss, right? Shouldn't miss, right? Engaging. Well, except for hitting the building. I hit something good. Yeah, he had it. There it is, folks. All right, well, that wasn't too bad. 791,000. All right, well, let's see what we get here. So the kills were even. Pretty much across the board. And once again, injured due to, stupili due to stupidity. But that's me, so there you go. Uh, Alright, now, storage. We got a crap ton of parts of everything here. So this is the... Yeah, the enhanced LRM version. But this was the... The rocket version. I, don't, I mean, it doesn't really matter at this point. We're here for specific things. Like, we're here for quick sell stuff, so... Is there anything that's amazing down here that I want to keep? Not really. Well, tier one patchworks though. That can use to that can be used to boost somebody's armor somewhere. Swarm LRMs. I mean, I guess if it's it's good if you're opening up components to be using swarms, but not that big of a deal. And then maybe yeah, we just go with the um, wait. What's the medium VSPL is sixty heat, ninety damage at three hundred and sixty meters. Ooh, and super lightweight. Decreased based upon your evasion. Multiply by number of evasion pips to the power of minus 0.35. Falls off to 40% of starting value at long range. That's a great point blank weapon, but if you don't, uh, like, ah, oh man, it's like a lot of heat. And if you're at operating at long ranges, it's a lot of heat for that. And right now we don't have any point blankers other than the, uh, trebuchet, but that's a lot of heat for that trebuchet to sink though. 
Let's grab this part. Because that's technically an Omni, right? It says 11 Ballistic, but it's not. It's just 11 hard points. Let's just grab that. Uh, confirm this. So we got arch, two Archer parts, Roughneck parts. Shaft countermeasures, enhanced LRM 15, which were, which weighs what, 9 tons? Yeah, we're not going to use that. Medium lasers can go. Medium pulses can go. The rocket 10s. I'll hold on to them. I mean, I'll probably never use them, but you never know. This, they're nice half-ton weapons. Ooh, 336,000. Yeah, I mean, what can you do? The armor on the Atlas, I think, is part of the problem, but it's fine. That's fine. We just have to make sure we go for bigger seabills. Yeah, because see, we were at, what, 200 and... We made like 500,000 on that, so not a lot. Not a lot. Probably what I'll do between episodes is assemble a couple of those mechs and just sell them off. I want to, like... Yeah. Wait, an the Annihilator? Okay. It said 44 days, and I was like, what? Better not be 44 days, but it's only because it's popping in after the Atlas. All right, 22 days. I guess, I, I don't know, that's brutal. That's brutal. All right, well, no big deal. We'll just get it, we'll get them going. They'll be ready for the end of the month. I mean, we like that's the advantage of having the couple of extra mechs, right? Because now we can just swap the uh, Bandersnatch and the... Uh, the Savage Wolf back in. So once the uh, two avatars are uh, back up and running again um, in two days, we'll have a full Lance again. So we can go again. We'll just have to wait for these guys to get repaired then. And I still haven't decided what I'm going to do with this thing. I'll probably just end up trashing it. But it's a it's a nice uh, look at what the lamb, the lamb playthrough is going to be like. Hopefully we can get something like this. That'd be cool as the backbone mech. I mean, it doesn't have a lot of weapons, but that's going to be the challenge, right? Is try and uh, maximize the um, the uh, utility of the flight. So, anyway, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.